Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. It's only a few more days until, actually let's see, let's see a couple more days until the ha Has Been Hotel official release on Prime Video comes out. Though, if you got early access on A24, I'm pretty sure you guys already saw it, but today Prime Video actually released another two minute sneak peek of the first episode of Has Been Hotel, so I'm actually going to react to it for you guys because, I mean, this show's just awesome. I mean, if you guys got early access, then you probably already know what this the first two minutes of the first episode was. But, I mean, this is actually a very interesting first two minutes if you guys haven't seen the show. So, I mean, let's get right into it, and then I'll give my reaction as to why it's very interesting. All right, give you the first two minutes of the first episode. Once upon a time, there was a glowing city protected by golden gates, known as Heaven. It was ruled by beings of pure light, angels that worshipped good and shielded all from evil. Lucifer was one of these angels. He was a dreamer with fantastical ideas for all of creation, but he was seen as a troublemaker by the elders of Heaven, for they felt his way of thinking was dangerous to the order of their world. So he watched as the angels began to expand the universe in their ways. From the dust of Earth, they created Adam and Lilith, equals as the first of mankind. But despite this, Adam demanded control, and Lilith refused to submit to his will. She fled the garden. Drawn in by her fierce independence, Lucifer found her, and the two rebellious dreamers fell deeply in love. Together, they wished to share the magic of free will with humanity, offering the fruit of knowledge to Adam's new bride, Eve, who gladly accepted. But this gift came with a curse, for with <laughs> this single act of disobedience, evil finally found its way into Earth. With it, a new realm of darkness and sin, and the order Heaven had worked to maintain was shattered. As punishment for their reckless act, Heaven cast Lucifer and his love into the dark pit he had created, never allowing him to see the good that came from humanity. Only the cruel and the wicked. Ashamed, Lucifer lost his will to dream. But Lilith thrived, empowering demonkind with her voice and her songs, and as the numbers of hell grew, so did its power. Threatened by this, Heaven made a truly heartless decision that every year they would send down an army, an extermination, to ensure hell and its sinners could never rise against them. But Lilith's hope remained, and her dream was passed down to their precious daughter, the princess of hell. Don't worry, Mom. I'll make you proud. <laughs> So, I mean, that's a interesting way, because usually when you hear stories like this about heaven and hell, they always depict, you know, Lucifer as evil and, like, you know, spirited and a guy who just created sin. In this way, he created sin, but not because he was evil, but because he was free-willed. And because, you know, heaven is all about order in this series, you know, his free will was all about, you know, it was something new gave people to believe that, you know, just because having created them, they still have their own choices. So, I mean, it's actually a much better, a very good story. It doesn't depict Lucifer as an evil person, but as a guy who was unique. And, of course, they thought his uniqueness was dangerous. And, I mean, also, i really like to know why Vivian Madrano kind of designed the angels to look kind of like imps. They actually look more evil than the, the demons do. <laughs> That's kind of interesting. Kind of a twist in a way. But, I mean, if you guys have seen this sneak peek, please uh, comment here down below what your thoughts are on it. Also, if also if you haven't seen the Has Been Hotel series, please tell me what you think in the comments, what you're expecting from it. Please. Because I still plan to react to the two ep to the first two episodes, even though I've already seen them. But also, also, if you like my other videos, don't forget to like and subscribe. I'll see you guys next time, and remember, stay epic.